Hello guys, most William here. Thank you for watching this video. In this video, I'm going. Uh, in this video, I'm really happy to back with another video of a portfolio. How you can create your, how you can design your portfolio in Figma, how you can create your slides in Figma. So this will be much helpful for you uh, to design, design your own site and to achieve any video, any any video you want to do in the video. Uh, so you can uh, just show your portfolio. Just what you have to do is to learn how to design in using 
my own design. You know, how do you see it, right? The suit has to, the suit, you know, should have that kind of skill set, right? So, all if you are seeing the side, you can use the right side, all these icons, it's all clickable. When I go, when I click on LinkedIn, it takes me to my LinkedIn profile. down I can also get my LinkedIn and other links from this plotting icons right and this functionality also I have done with Figma prototype you can view this case study okay when I click on case study it will show me it will show my portfolio my case study my UX case study which I have done with the UX folio and this uh, project, uh, this case study and project, my portfolio have done in last year, uh, which, will, which would be very much beneficial for me, you know, to show all this. So this is my process. This is the UX process, user journey, then uh, customer journey, all these kind of case study I have put it in this link. You can see you the pick uh, my mobile app customer journey all these I created myself I created the sketches before going to start and before going to make my case study I have created sketches rough sketches after that uh, I created wireframes you can view this wireframe then I created UI design all these I have uh, written here you can view and after that I have also created fitness app prototype you can view my prototype and click here takes me to this prototype. You can view my prototype here. It's linked with Figma prototype link. After that, these are my these are some of my UI design of this app. Then you can view whole my whole case study here. You can contact me for any kind of related any uh, with any project, with any issues that you face anytime, you can contact me here. It's a workable and you know, it's workable link here, right? Okay, so this is my portfolio, it is my case study link. And uh, if I scroll down, this is my latest work on Dribble. When I click uh, one of them, and you see, if you see this, uh, when I hover here, it you know appears like black and when I hover on button it will show you filled button filled with white background 
So all these facts I have done with Figma. You can view when I click on view sort. Yeah, when I click on view sort, it will appear something like this. This is also a functionality that I have done with Figma. So 9.9 k views all these I have designed myself in Figma and prototype myself in Figma. When I go and click on go to dribble, it will take takes you to my dribble profile. Okay. As you are seeing here. And when I go back, close this, it will disappear. So same functionality you can use with your projects with any project that you have designed okay put all your projects in one particular link make your own site make your own portfolio make your own portable site like this which i have done so far this is whether this is my youtube channel link but i have put it here all these are slight all these are sliders i have uh, uh, designed here and make it functional with figma prototype so you can see my videos on youtube so i put it all this in one particular link one particular site one particular home page landing page and you can view my youtube channel from this link all these links with my channel and my other you know social media accounts and profile you can view my channel so you can view the and if you want to if you want to click here if you want to view my youtube videos like if you want to view this youtube video I click here and this play button will take me to my youtube channel like this all these are linked with Sigma. In this video is so you can view my channel and view my videos how to become my so this is my channel and uh, if you wanna uh, if you wanna get more videos like this more tutorials more videos so please subscribe to my youtube channel and uh, i really need your support it's uh, right now 61 subscribers i want your support and uh, with your support i can grow myself my channel and everything so really want you to subscribe my channel and you know like my videos so it would help me to grow myself right so here's what i have created so far these sliders okay so i show you this is my certificate which i have done with uh, I, in idf i have done course with I, in idf so is my uh, is my certificate after that you are seeing my linkedin learning some of my ux certificates here which i have uh, that which i have you know done with linkedin i have learned a lot of things in linkedin you can see some of many ux design you know certificates from linkedin that's all which I have done so far and all attached all things I have attached in this site which I have created in Figma all these are functionable you know functional so you can also view and get inspiration from this site and also make your also design and make your own site same like this and I, I will also give this link to my to my description to my youtube description and you can uh, get and view my site from there and so hope you guys understand and uh, like this video and understand how you can uh, how you can design your own site and uh, portfolio with figma how you can prototype all the things in figma so hope you get knowledge from this hope you enjoy this video and really uh, really appreciate you if you subscribe my channel and like my video uh, over my youtube channel and view my other videos of logo designing and other UX designing uh, how you can design your logo how you can design your you know other user experiences what is UX design all this stuff i have uh, done in my youtube channel you can view my videos here so all this you will get there and so one more thing that I have forgot to tell you here, which is uh, if you want to see all the things like how I make it functional, so just that thing I want to show you here, only for you I am going to show you how you can create that. So same in Figma, if you see this is, I have designed so far, this is my site, okay, and 
if you are seeing these buttons you can view how i have done how i have to make this functional you can view the prototype here while hovering all these facts i have given with figma in figma okay so if you want to learn how to make prototype all this how to make this kind of functionality in your site so go to www.figma.com and view and learn how to prototype and design with figma okay how to prototype in figma so all this you can do in figma you can view how i have done this functionality all this you can search on link uh, on figma and get it from there also you can view my channel and learn from there as well so uh, so this is so far this is so far which i have done now and uh, so just i'm going to just finish this video it will hope it will helpful for you thank you thank you so much for watching this video